The Day of the Dead, El Día de los Muertos, by Bob Barner. We celebrate our ancestors on the Day of the Dead with offerings of flowers, sugar skulls, and bread. We make tacos, empanadas, mole, and treats. Smell incense that burns smoky and sweet. Before we go out, everything must be done. Pack up our bundles before the setting sun. Under twinkling stars and the moon going bright. Light the candles that flicker with soft yellow light. Mark a path for the spirits with the petals of flowers. We dance, sing, and remember the loved ones for hours. Celebrate our ancestors on the day of the dead. We smell the sweet flowers as we lie down for bed. About El Dia de los Muertos. Millions of people from Mexico in parts of Central and South America observe one of Latin America's most popular holidays called El Dia de los Muertos in Spanish and the Day of the Dead in English. It is a special time for remembering loved ones who are no longer living and is celebrated every year from October 31st until November 2nd. People prepare for the holiday by baking or buying special foods. Pan de Muertos, or Bread of the Dead, is a sweet bread baked only for this special holiday. It has a tiny skeleton doll baked inside. The person lucky enough to get the little skeleton in his or her piece of bread can make a wish that will come true. Sugar skulls or calaveras de azúcar come decorated in bright colors. They can be eaten at the end of the celebration. People also gather the favorite foods of their deceased loved ones. Tamales are a popular treat at the celebrations. They are cornmeal cakes filled with meat wrapped in a corn husk and steamed before eating. Altars for the departed decorated with sempasuchil or marigolds and candles are displayed in homes and schools. Sweet smelling incense is burned to attract the spirits of the departed. On the night of November 2nd, families go to the cemetery. They spread the petals of marigold flowers, burn incense and light candles to welcome the spirits to the celebration. Then they dance, sing, have a picnic and share memories of their loved ones. Families leave the flowers on the graves at the end of the celebration as they begin their journey home. The popular Mexican artist, Jose Guadalupe Posada, inspired some of the skeleton characters in this book. His engravings of skeletons and the skeleton lady with a large flowered hat, La Catrina, have become symbols of the Day of the Dead holiday. The End